we still have the current system. We still have a lot of people that pay too much and, and uh, have deductibles that are way too high and pay too much for drugs. Uh, we have, yeah, keep that sign up for crying out loud. <laughs> but we, we do, we pay way too much for drugs. And you know, uh, one thing that I was unhappy about was that uh, uh, the Senate just uh, voted down uh, allowing uh, drugs to be bought from Canada. Hmm. And, the, and the, the excuse was, well, we can't be sure that they have the same safety standard. <laughs> and, and I laughed too. I laughed too because, um, you know, if people were dropping like flies from poison <laughs> medicine in Canada, we might have heard about it. Um, I have a question. Why won't Congress of the United States allow them to negotiate that's the other thing. Is the that only thing that do is their own the right. If you didn't hear the question, and that is, thank you for that. That, uh, that is, uh, that's a big problem. Uh, the VA system is allowed to negotiate with uh, pharmaceutical companies for drug prices, but so, but Medicare is not. Medicare is not allowed to. Okay, remember I talked about how big money controlled oil and gas and how they're exempt from EPA. You think that there's anything going on there about big pharma? You yeah. bet there is. Um, and uh, uh, it's all about the money. That's what it is. You turn on the, the NBC News, the CBS News, the ABC News, what's every other commercial? It's drugs. It takes a you know how expensive that is to advertise on those news programs?